very warm welcome to our interview, Consulting for Process Industries. Hello, Dieter. Nice to have you here. Thanks, Gerd. I'm happy to be here. Yeah. Um, the, our um, process industry customers are asking Siemens for help on their digital transformation journey. We know that some of them already heard about the Siemens service offering, which includes consulting, implementation and optimization. So um, what does that mean for our customers? And my question is, um, what is their unique benefit? Yeah. Thanks, Gerd, to give me the chance to uh, describe that a little bit for our customers. Um, Siemens has put the customer in the absolute middle of his organization. And during that, we want to add value to the customer. So our customers are facing a lot of challenges in the industry. And by adding our new portfolio elements to our offering, we can support the customers exactly and in detail that they get more out uh, and had a value in their processes. So we have another guest. Hello, Steve. Nice to have you here. Hi, Gerd. It's a pleasure to be here. Steve, well, based on your many years of experience helping customers integrating new processes, please tell us why is consulting so important? Yeah, this is a great question. And when, con when companies are starting the digital transformation, they are considering many KPIs and many part of the organization. And of course, some of them can do that by themselves. But in many cases, this is requiring a lot of various skills and also uh, to assess a lot of various KPIs that are fitting their strategy. For example, some of them will focus more on the efficiency. Some of them will focus more maybe on the scalability. Um, and, and all these KPIs are interconnected. And that's why sometimes bringing an outside in view mm -hmm. is helping them a little bit to step back mm -hmm. and to really start again to understand what are the main priorities? What are the main projects I should, Im I should implement? But the, why shouldn't do customers that on their own? Uh, that's an interesting question because our customers, they have a lot of know-how and experts working out their challenges, maybe their ideas to improve. Siemens uh, on this side can offer a lot of portfolio elements, a lot of solution activities and combining these things in a joint team, customer and Siemens can create a lot of ideas and optimization potential so that the customer has finally added value for his process and get more out of this plant. I see. Well, either there are other companies offering uh, consulting, um, maybe refers also to plant life cycle or digital transformation. But my question is, what makes Siemens different? Siemens has done a totally different approach compared to some of our customers, of our competitors, sorry. Um, Siemens combines process know-how or domain know-how of process steps, of process activities with digitalization and automation know-how. That means Siemens owns in process engineers, chemist, chemists, which are day by day work on this area. They are doing continuously conceptual studies basic engineering for new plants, optimization of process steps, so-called unit operations, and combining these two topics, process knowledge and automation knowledge, makes us unique in this area. Awesome. So after we heard Dieter's answer, Steve, would you like to add something? Yes. So indeed, the domain know-how and the industry expertise are critical, but I would say there are other points as well. We have a global footprint. It means that we can consult a global customer who have plants uh, or, or production facilities everywhere around the world. Mm -hmm. And that we can do it with around about our 300 consultants that we have. I mean, some of them are strategic consultants, some of them are more process consultants, some of them are IT experts or automation or cybersecurity. And all in all, we have this team of 300 consultants that we can gather on on the spot to do a consulting process. And of course, uh, uh, Siemens is a technology leader. So meaning that when we talk about digitalization consulting with new technologies and, and their implementation, uh, we need to bring the right experts. And then Siemens here has been showing uh, over decades uh, how we yeah. are leading the development of those technology. And therefore, our experts are really at the edge of that. And um, it's very important for our customers. It's not only about consulting, as you were referring before, uh, the CIO. It's consulting and uh, integration and optimization. And uh, here, uh, we have an end-to-end -end solution. So it means mm -hmm. that not only we are doing the consulting, but we can also go from the really beginning of the consulting 
up to the implementation at the end and uh, the uh, uh, service operations. So this is very important for our customers to have a complete package sometimes from what should I do and then completely do it. And that again, Siemens here is well positioned globally to serve those customers. Can you give us some examples? Sure. So one of an example that comes up in my mind is we got a request from a customer he want to start the journey of digital transformation with his company and ask us to support him. And we dived in, we not just came up with portfolio or with products, we just start with analysis. We looked in each and every area of his process, if his process is prepared to start the digital journey. What means that? For example, in the most of the process industry steps, you have valves. And every valve need a positioner to give a digital feedback how that is. So we analyzed that, every detail, made a roadmap, and made an evaluation what he has to invest and what he gets back on his investment. What this means, finally, he could do a priorization on return of invest and can figure out what is the best for him, step by step, seeing the whole, whole investment on the roadmap side. This gives him a unique situation to really decide when he spends his money. Thank you very much, Dieter. You are welcome. So we had that very interesting example from Dieter. Do you have another one, Steve? Yes, um, we have also on the same global uh, example. We have, um, we have a customer in China producing glass um, mm -hmm. and he has a global production network. And then here he was uh, interested to leverage digitalization for improving his production efficiency, reducing his energy consumption, and also improving uh, or let's say decreasing the waste that you were having during the production. And here again, we have been starting by consulting that on a typical plant that he has, mm -hmm. um, just bringing him to the to the uh, bringing the roadmap for the next step of digitalization level, and then consulting him on how now to roll this out across the other plants. And that's a typical consulting project. Mm -hmm. And now again, since we have now built a lot of trust with this customer, we know very well its processes. We know very well the, the way uh, the production is managed over there. Then we are well positioned as well to implement the change. So basically completely increasing the automation network, uh, looking at the cybersecurity and so on and so on and so on. Steve, thank you very much for your answers and your time. So now we have heard that Siemens supports customers with a variety of consulting services during their digital transformation. In a nutshell, these consulting services help customers to identify the critical points and last but not least, it helps them to start with the right things first. Thank you very much. Thank you, Steve. Thank you, Gerd. Siemens, ingenuity for life.